Good morning, 47. The board has sanctioned Eric Soda's for termination. After Colorado, we did some digging into Soda's private affairs and discovered that he has been fast-tracked for critical heart surgery at the hyper-exclusive Gama Private Hospital in Hokkaido, Japan. Such a display of power has Providence written all over it. Soda's, who suffers from a rare condition known as situs inversus, where his internal organs are reversed, desperately needs a right-sided heart transplant and has clearly betrayed the ICA to get it. He was admitted last night and is currently being prepped for a three-day surgery. We have booked you into Gama under the usual guise of Tobias Reaper, corporate shark, here for a standard medical checkup. As such, you will need to play it by ear and procure whatever tools you need to complete the mission. You also need to eliminate Yuki Yamazaki, a Tokyo lawyer who works for Providence. Sodas has already given Yamazaki access to our client records and has agreed to provide a full list of active ICA operatives post-operation. This transaction cannot be allowed to happen. Sodas must pay for his treachery and his insidious employers must be taught a lesson. ICA's sovereignty is at stake. Powerful as Providence may be, we need to draw a line in the sand. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome to Hokkaido 47. The Gama Private Hospital provides cutting edge medical treatment for the global elite outside the law if required. The facility is partially run by an artificial intelligence system known as Kai. The AI oversees patient admission to various areas in the hospital and even participates in some medical procedures. You will find Eric Soders in the operating theater undergoing a pre-surgery regenerative stem cell treatment, a highly controversial procedure yet to be approved by Japanese authorities. Yuki Yamazaki has already arrived. You'll find her in her suite or roaming the restaurant and spa areas of the hospital. Sodas is scheduled to be put under soon. Let us make sure he stays that way. Good luck, 47. Hey, buddy. Oh, that was disrespectful of me. I'm, uh, I'm very sorry. Hope you have everything you need. That's a little harsh, isn't it? A total ban? I don't know. The patient did die. Famous word, that. Still, it's not the chef's fault. What was the kitchen apprentice thinking, cutting out a fugu fish by himself unsupervised? And it takes years of practice. Didn't the kid realize how poisonous those things are? Yeah, he's a kid. Probably wanted to show off, I don't know. Anyway, the hospital administration probably thought it would be better to just ban serving food to all together. Poor chef. That was his best party trick. Now, what do we do with the last fugu? Uh, 
throw it out, I guess. <laughs> it's a damn shame, too. The chef had to refuse serving Yuki Yamazaki his signature dish. <laughs> I mean, despite her constant requests. She asked about it just an hour ago. It's really too bad. Well, it's not worth Gama has banned the serving of fugu following an incident where a guest was poisoned by a poorly carved piece of the poisonous fish. It appears, however, that Yuki Yamazaki is trying to sway the chef to slice up his final specimen and serve it to her. Who are we to deny her such pleasure, 47? I have intel. Well, this is quite fascinating. The bandaged patient is Jason Portman, former CEO of Quantum Leap. According to my intel, he has undergone full facial reconstruction and is scheduled for bandage removal today. And get this, he's going for the full Helmut Kruger look. Come on, come on, why? None of you service staff through here. Yeah, yeah, no crying. Just move on.
Jason Portman. Please come to the hospital entrance. A doctor will escort you to your checkup. That was for Mr. Jason Portman. A doctor will escort you to your appointment. Please proceed to the hospital entrance. Mr. Cook? Hey, Chef, you can't come through here. Use the kitchen entrance, Red Zeppi. God damn. Um, excuse me. Could I ask you for some fugu hey, roll? Man. A thousand apologies, and keep but cooking. the hospital administration has put a ban on pufferfish. There was an, uh, incident only last week. A kitchen apprentice to put himself to. Uh, excuse me. Delicate sushi can be saved right here. I just prepared a fresh batch. Is this fugu? I knew you would come around eventually. Good for you. I hope you like it. My colleague is a straight arrow. Me, I say it's good to live dangerously. You took the words right out of my mouth. Mmm, yes, mm, That's exactly right. Smooth. Get down. Now it's time for Sodas to retire. Follow me to the consultation room, if you please. You must be eager to see the new you. Gentlemen, Mr. Portman is with me. That's right. No need to Move bother on, him people. with unnecessary security measures. Must be good to get out a little, stretch those legs. I do love the options available here at Gamma, but I imagine it can get tedious to lie in bed all day. If you haven't been to the gym yet, you should really go. Hope you're holding up all right. I read the latest test results that Kai published on the internal network. You're in good shape, Mr. Portman. Might want to cut back on the sake, but otherwise you're doing well. Should be able to go back home real soon. You're in good hands, Mr. Portman. Gom is such an incredible place. The medical facilities are beyond... Facial surgery tends to heal pretty quickly, but I understand yours was quite extensive. Don't worry, though. We've got the best facilities here. You'll get those bandages off in no time at all. Nice to see you. Keep walking. Okay, Mr. Portman, your surgeon is in here. He should be ready for your checkup. Have a nice day. Smart way to get inside, 47. Mr. Portman, well done. thank you for waiting. If you Hello, could sir. just sit down for a moment, I'll get started right away. So, let's have a look at you, Mr. Portman. I'll be still as I remove the bandages. Oh. Oh, my. It's... It's, it's astonishing. Not only are you... The spitting image of Helmut Kruger, the, the swelling has completely subsided and there's not a trace of bruising. If I didn't know any better, I'd, I'd say you'd never undergone surgery. It's... it's perfect. It's simply perfect. I'm, I'm sorry. This is, uh... this is very emotional for me.
Hey, so you're the curator's research aide, right? Let me guess. You want to know about the medical trial? Uh, so it is true. The, the guy's had a mood-altering neurochip implanted in his brain. So, so how does it work? Uh, does it work? Sorry, you're just gonna have to wait for my research paper. I'm following the trial closely, and with a little luck, he'll be the basis for my doctorate. All I can say is that I've got a very interesting bit of insight into his mental state. Fine, fine, I'll just have to ask. Dr. Katashi Ito, also known as the curator, is participating in some sort of medical trial. Interesting. The curator oversees the hospital's organ storage facility and surely has access to Soda's donor heart. I suggest you locate the research assistant's report, 47, and find out what this neural implant is for. Could prove useful. Jeez. Well, so someone should go and see what the hell that was. Okay. Bringing joy to the world now, 47. Well, let's see where this takes him, shall we? That is the right side of Donor Heart destined for sodas. This is what he sold out the ICA for. second right-sided heart in time, you have effectively killed him without laying a hand on him. This should be a clear message to anyone considering following in his footsteps. That's both targets down. Time to find an exit. We're done here. What's up with the sudden limp on our resident yoga master? Hmm, I noticed that. I heard him complain about it. Ticket says. We received your message. Loud and clear, I might add. Honestly, you could have just sacked the poor guy. I didn't catch your name. No, you didn't. There'll be no retaliation. Not for Soders, nor any other recent fiascos. Someone's been meddling in our affairs. Killing our operatives. And making the ICA look like fools. I think you 
got close to that someone. Closer than we've ever been. That's why we're hiring you to take him down. I don't think so. Don't rattle our cages, Miss Burnwood. You really have no idea. You spy on us, bribe our people, and you have the gall to demand our help. No. You can't be trusted. Even so, we've been around for a long, long time. I think we could help each other. Some 20 years ago, your agency took in a young man with no past and extraordinary skills. In his own special way, he cares about you and vice versa. And ever since that time, you've never stopped wondering where he came from and who made him what he is. There was a doctor, some depraved experiment. But he's gone now. Ah. Well, if you believe the questions died with him, we have nothing further to discuss. If not, as I said, I think we could help each other. Partners, then. Cheer up, Miss Burnwood. We... <laughs> we are the lesser evil. This terrorist. He wants nothing but chaos. He's only a terrorist if you win. Miss Burnwood, we won a long time ago. This... <laughs> this is maintenance.
Just cause we're a million miles away